Hey guys, MDL here. So today's video is going to be a bit different. It's not going to be the same highlight video or usual gameplay. It's going to be five tips to get better at Fortnite. So this is going to improve your one-to-one -one fight, your close encounters, your building, and all that type of thing. So one of the main things that I'm going to be showing you today is how to outsmart your opponent like Ninja does, like Myth does, like um, Cypher does and all them professionals who you see every day on YouTube, Twitch and all that type of thing. So if you watch any of their videos you will notice that they do all these tips that I'm going to be showing you today and I can guarantee you after this video you will be a lot better on your one to one or building battles or anything like that type of situations so let's jump right into it so the first tip here is editing so editing is very important it can get you out of a lot of trouble in my life. so the first thing um, in this clip is me locked up in a box so I lost the high ground blocked myself up I needed to reload my guns and all that so uh, my opponent started shooting my wall so I built a ramp and the ramp is to give me a bit more time for when he's reloading because when he's shooting all his bullets he's going to have to reload eventually and um, the thing to do is when he is reloading you've got a 2-3 second time gap to turn to your wall edit the corner of the wall jump out like I'm doing right now um, line up the shot with your shotgun and uh, boom there you go headshot and that's what you should be doing or switch to your SMG when you hit him if he's got health so in this other clip I'm landing someone shooting at me um, I've got um, a sniper and a gold scar so when you've got a gold scar you know you can get them good long headshots so what, what I would do when um, I'm at a long distance and I'm fighting is build my one by one, make sure I'm always covered and always try and change the angle of where I'm shooting, always use your angles so shoot from the, from the top right of your base, go to the top left of your base edit a hole in your wall like I'm doing on here and try and get a couple of shots in but always make sure you re-edit your wall because you could easily throw a grenade in, grenade launcher, snipe, or shoot you with an AR and all sorts like that because obviously you, you're you not covered there but that's a really really good way to catch someone by surprise and, and kill them really so tip number two reinforcing your wall well you build so what I mean by that is when you're pushing someone and you're ramping don't just build a ramp because they can easily be shot down and you lose your high ground there so what you want to do is you build a ramp and a wall a ramp and a wall so you've got more time then to uh, catch him by surprise whilst you're shooting your ramp and wall down so this this tip is easy but very efficient and it works very very well from a distance as you can see always try and tag your opponent always try and get as many bullets as you can from a distance with your AR because if you're in a build battle like I am right now after you've just pushed him and you've not got any shots in at all you're going to need more than one pump shot or one a couple of bullets to kill him with uh, your SMG because you've not weakened him whereas if you do that and get him weak from the start when you build up to him and you reach the high ground all you need is one shot whereas obviously he's going to have to shoot you a couple more times because he's not done that and you've got full shield and full health and all that type of thing so that's why I think this is a very good tip so one of my tips to you is go and play a lot of high ground and test your reactions so what I mean by that is try and jump off by a build off a building and try and build your way down so it's it's difficult to explain this but you'll see in this video when I'm falling I'm building a wall a wall and a, and a ramp a wall a wall and the floor that way when you fall down you won't um, get any damage fall damage because obviously you stopping yourself from falling it's very hard and I'm still learning this now and struggling with it but practice makes perfect doesn't it so all you have to do is keep playing keep practicing keep playing play playground with your friends 
and just keep practicing this, this technique because it can be very very helpful especially when you're panicking and you fall off your build <laughs> So tip number five, always try to keep the high ground. The high ground is very important on Fortnite, especially after all these players have gotten so good with their aim, with their accuracy and everything like that. So when, when you're in a build battle and someone's beating you and they're above you, you will let shots off at the body, so not the head, so the, their chest, their tummy, their legs and all that. So you won't get as much damage as if you were above them and you're getting headshots because you can get 150 headshots like you just seen there 90 headshots 180 headshots or whatever so quite obviously that is the most damage you can do on the player that's why the high ground is so important and that's why a lot of people like tfu uh, ninja are always trying to build up and build up and build up. I know sometimes they do jump off and they try and get all these fancy kills with uh, snipers and no scopes and all this, but if, you, if you're not a, play, a pro player and you want to get a good kill and keep on going with your game, the safest way will always be get the high ground. So this has been my five tips to improve on Fortnite. Make sure you go on Playground, test them out and let me know in the comment section how you feel about them. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe.